officially almost done with this semester. It's my study. Do productive things. Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Amina and I'm back with another vlog. As you guys can see by the title, I am doing a part two of my finals vlog. So if you haven't watched part one, make sure you guys click above because I'll link it in this video so that you guys can tune in. So we are officially, officially, officially almost done with this semester. And boy, when I tell you it has been intense, it has been intense. So I'm currently studying for my last final of my second semester of PA school, which is my physiology exam. This exam, I'm not too pressed about. As our pathophysiology exam aligned with the topics that we have for this upcoming exam for the pathophysiology exam that I took on Monday it was a mix of renal GI I believe just mainly those two and honestly when I tell you guys like in a lot of what we're learning now is correlating with that and we're also learning about the endocrine system which we also learned about from one of our previous pathophysiology exams so it should be a breeze studying for this it's just like remembering the information as well as doing practice questions to get myself prepared for the exam itself so my plan essentially today is to get some lunch i'm probably going to stop at this thai restaurant called thai holic i think i mentioned about it in my part one of this vlog but i didn't end up going but i'm gonna go there get some thai food and then i am gonna go to a cafe and just watch the rest of the lecture videos for today and then once i finish watching the videos i do have to review everything that i watch essentially so in that way i'm studying the material and I also plan on editing my YouTube vlog which will be out by the time I post this video so make sure you guys go also check that out it's been more than a week since I last posted a video obviously not now I'm talking in past tense by the time that you guys see this video um it's been nine days since I posted a video and I've been trying to post weekly but I haven't had time to edit the vlog that I plan on posting on Sunday hopefully if I get this editing done today and tomorrow but I had such an intense week i had three exams so bear with me you guys i'm gonna stop rambling and make my way to get some food because my stomach is rumbling and i'm so hungry <laughs> so i made it um they are playing music so i'm not gonna be able to talk but i'll show you guys like you know little snippets all right guys so i left the restaurant um, my experience there was pretty good it wasn't packed at all it was a nice time and day to go for a solo date so today is friday i don't even think i mentioned that at the beginning of this vlog but today is friday today is december 8th to be exact 3 29 p.m <laughs> the owner was super duper nice he subscribed to my youtube channel so if you're watching hi and thank you so much for giving me such a good customer experience if you guys love thai food and are located in brooklyn or are willing to travel to brooklyn to try some good thai food you might want to hit up thai holic in brooklyn it's on myrtle avenue and you won't be disappointed so check them out now on to the cafe to study all right you guys so i made it to a cafe i'm about to order something really quickly and then start studying i'm aiming to watch about like five lectures today which is probably going to take me five hours maybe four i'm really aiming to be done before i leave this cafe so let's see how well i'm able to do today
Yo, why does my voice sound like this? I'm sorry, you guys. I just woke up probably like an hour and a half ago. Um, good morning. <laughs> it's officially the following day, Saturday. I have two more days before my physiology final exam. I don't think I picked up the camera when I got home yesterday. I was honestly just too tired and lazy to record. I didn't do any work once I got home. I just pretty much relaxed. So today is pretty much finished what I started yesterday as well as start studying for the exam. Um, I have a pretty long day. I'm planning to to stay well i'm going to this cafe right now it's called tb coffee shop it's pretty cute i went there last saturday and then i'm switching over to this different cafe and i'm supposed to be meeting my friend there um susan you guys met susan in multiple of my previous vlogs but yeah we're gonna do like a study day we're not in the same program of course but it's really nice to study with your friends or like you know just do productive cafe dates with your friends that are in school or not in school it just makes you feel good because you get to see your friends that you barely see as well as you know do productive things yeah <laughs> but that's the plan for today so I'll just um, update you guys once I reach the cafe and I got my usual which is a dirty iced vanilla chai latte to a little taste test it's okay about to start setting up and just get straight into studying probably gonna spend like three to four hours at this cafe then switch over to the next one it is 10 20 right now so I'll show you guys the time when I'm done and heading out I ended up leaving the cafe and I went through. Hey y'all, I'm trying to see you. I know. Uh, we ordered our food, so we're about to get it and yeah, then studying after. Good morning. It's the next day. Unfortunately, I forgot to vlog for you guys while we were studying. And after uh, me and Susan finished studying at that cafe, we went to this like cute little dessert spot. But yeah, it was pretty nice. Susan bought me two cupcakes. Um, I picked the chocolate one and a vanilla bean one. I only tried the chocolate one, but it was pretty good. Today is officially the day before my test and I have a lot to cram because last night when I got home, I didn't do no studying. It was a more of a self-care relaxing type of night for me. So I'm here at the library and by the looks of it, no one else is here. <laughs> but um one more final so we're going to make sure we're focused today and just getting this done so we could be free at last <laughs> studying i'm almost done reviewing um my reno lecture notes and right now i'm about to join like a little i guess you could say group um review 
I don't even know why I got an attitude. I'm just so tired and drained. But yeah, I was originally just supposed to like um go over like little notes with Carmen. Gurgis is also draining. You guys met Gurgis before in my previous vlog. And um yeah. Girl, how to share my screen again? Share. So um this is the chemical structure for it. Um I don't think we're responsible to know like the, how it looks like from here. So the thyroid hormones. So uh, the anterior pituitary gland is going to release the thyroid stimulating hormone and it's going to go to the thyroid gland, which is going to release T4 and T3. But T4 is released more than T3 and T3 is the active form and T4 can convert into T3 eventually. Yeah. This one is basically it's from the hypothalamus. So that there is a chain so there is a hypothalamus on the top all right you guys so it is um 10 46 p.m and we're just wrapping up our review so session they're still talking it's, it's um but i'm about to go home and then the plan is to resume this review session and then um we have like one more reno lecture to do and then after that we're probably gonna move on to the endocrine review and that's the plan for the rest of the night <laughs> Say bye. <laughs> oh my God. Good morning, guys. As you guys can see, or if you can't, it's raining. Um, whatever. Today is officially the day of my exam. I'm sitting in my car because I have to unfortunately wait for street cleaning. I don't have time to search for parking and spend minutes doing that when I have to study. Like, literally, it's 7 10 a.m. right now. I wanted to start studying by 6 a.m., but. <sighs> life so i have about two hours no less than two hours before my exam because my exam starts at nine so i'm hoping to get like some studying done before that i'm just gonna like review some of my notes as well as like review like my weak points and then um yeah i'm just gonna hope for the best so diabetes mellitus causes an osmotic diuresis whereas diabetes insipidus causes a water diuresis so diabetes mellitus is osmotic diuresis, diabetes insipidus is water diuresis. If no antidiuretic hormone were present in someone's plaza, their urine would be, um, it wouldn't be less, it would be less concentrated. So it's going to be high in volume and low in osmolarity. Loop of Heno and its counter current multiplier system is necessary for the creation of urine. So more dilute and a creation of urine more concentrated than 300 milliliter osmolarity. So I'm about to help um, set up the board. Wait, what? Ooh, look at you go, girl. Don't play Hurry up. up. Hurry up. I said you have the scissors. She got the scissors in her hand. Watch out. <laughs> <laughs> a little. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually fun. Therapeutic. Such a man. Such a man. I don't know what this means. I'm going to just let you run. <laughs> What's the one that you need to do? So we finished setting up the board. How do you guys feel to be almost done? Because we got to submit this so assignment. Excited. Can't wait to get nine hours of sleep mm. every night. Just pretty girl things. How do you feel to be almost done with the semester? I feel so happy. Okay. So proud of everyone. Woo! To be almost done. Mm. Time to celebrate, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I feel happy. Um, I'm gonna go home and sleep it off. Static to be done. I'm so happy. One step closer. We finished the final exam. And then homegirl's over here sleeping, taking a nap. How do I feel yes. to be done with this exam? I feel so relieved and free. 99% free because the 1% I have to do assignments tomorrow though. That's tomorrow's problem period like this is the lighting better this Hey guys, so look where we ended up 
cornbread cafe again this is like my third time going within a week and y'all when i tell you guys today the food was so bad oh my god look at that look at that this look at how food. i picked oh my up god. my food oh my god and it stinks for some reason the spinach yeah but um yeah we're about to just depart and like i'm about to head home and yeah